What's up everybody? Another Arcade Talk video coming at you. Today I'm going to discuss a new lightsaber coming to Galaxy's Edge. That's right guys, there's a new lightsaber coming to Galaxy's Edge. So come with me as we check this thing out. Hi, this is T. McCluskey coming at you and this is Arcade Talk. Welcome everybody, hopefully you're having a great morning, afternoon, evening, or night, wherever you're in the world. Hopefully you're having a great one. Today I'm going to check out this new lightsaber coming to Galaxy's Edge. That's right, the new lightsaber is coming to Galaxy's Edge, and most likely it's probably going to come out this summer. And it's coming to the Savvy Workshop. That's right, it's coming to the Savvy Workshop where you build your own lightsaber. So, I'm going to pull it up here. There it is, new lightsaber coming to Savvy Workshop. So there it is. This came out to courtesy of Sir James Gamer Fusion. He is one that posted this on his community post. I saw it. I'm like, ah, I gotta do a video real quick. Tell people that a new lightsaber is coming. So he posted this a little bit ago, 19 minutes ago, actually. New scrap metal is coming to Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Savvy Workshop here is a sample of the new power and control set. Old design will be going away. So this is gonna be the new power and control for the Savvy Workshop. So the old one will be going away so this one's they're going to add this one and then take the old one away makes sense um which is kind of cool because you know you had so many people building these so now you get people back in the park to build a new power and control so it makes total sense why they would do it big money game but it looks pretty cool so the old design goes away the new one comes in this this is coming out of the star wars convention that's going on right now out in anaheim california it started yesterday and it goes through the weekend it looks like he's in some kind of auditorium because you can see ceiling tiles up here and then it looks like there's people down here down here now it looks so it looks like he took a screenshot of a screen so then you can see this is coming soon so i'm thinking it might, it might come out next month which is june so it might come out real quick so there it is there's a look at it so there it is there's a close-up to it best i can get I'm not sure how you do a full screen on this thing i don't use paint that much but I think you can get a zist of what it looks going to look like. It looks pretty cool. So this is power control. So I think this is like, uh, would be the Sith side, right? I think that's what it is. But it looks pretty cool. You got some wires coming down here, red wires. You got some red on the thing. You know what I need to do? Let's see if I can pull up an old power and control. So here's the old design for power and control. This is one of the boards they would have at Savvy's that you could look at. So here's the old one. So you can see it still has the black and silver and red. You know, you have the red stripes and stuff in different areas on here. So there's the old one. And then this is the new one. Wow, they look totally different. D don't mind uh, the skinniness and all that and the fatness. That's just, you know, the pictures that, you know, shown it that way. They're going to be the same. They're not going to change the chassis, so they're going to be the same length as the old ones. My pictures are skewing. You know the fat you know the fatness and the length and all that so ignore the lengths so see here you still got the red in here but this one over here is kind of cool because it actually has some wet red wires coming around and stuff so that's pretty cool and then this one here has the black fins over here and the old one kind of had the same thing so you can see here there's the fins right here but that, they look different though like they're a little closer together here it looks more spread apart they're down they sit down lower they're actually like pieces instead of being up on top like the old one old design so it's kind of still similar that piece is let's see this piece here this looks like kind of like um this one except for that without this piece here kind of looks like that has that little piece coming up in the air darth vader's is kind of like that i'm always dropping stuff darth vader's is kind of like this too hey you know has a piece coming up so it looks kind of like darth vader's this piece here it has some gold it looks like instead of red and then here's the old one again see this piece here looks totally different it was pure black and you know yeah and, and this one here it looked totally different the emitters so that's pretty cool not the greatest pictures i mean i, I could back this one out a little bit more for you it might give you a little better perspective it was almost a little too close there's 100 percent and then that's kind of what's kind of cool in here i just noticed is you got these black fins coming up 
over here, they actually had the same thing down here, down on the bottom. So, which I think is totally different on this one. So, here's the end caps here. You know, you got the kind of like a cone shape and then a flat, you know, flat round shape. And this new one, yeah, it's still, the end cap is still round on this one, but it's a different shape. And then this one here, like I said, it kind of has the same things as the, you know, the emitter does. So that's pretty cool. And it has almost looks like a grip thing around it right there. And then you got the red stripe there. And it looks like there's red on the bottom of the end cap too, which is kind of cool. You can't really tell on this here. And then it looks like you got the different type of D-rings. This one here looks like a maybe a round D-ring. This one here kind of looks like a rectangle almost on the D, you know, for the D-ring. So that's kind of cool. The grips, both grips look smooth. This one here has some metal on it and some black might be like a rubber. And this one here looks like it's, it might be all rubber. And the grips on the old one, or I should say sleeves, because, you know, you can hit, have the sleeve up top and have the sleeve bottom. And the sleeve on the bottom is your grip, basically. So this is your different types of grips here. They look totally different. Maybe I should... Squat that picture down a little bit. So that, that looks a little better. And then this here, this grip on this one, or sleeve, looks like Darth Vader's. Like Darth Vader's has the, you know, the grips, the rubber grips on that one. And I don't think neither new one has that. I mean, this looks like it might be a black rubber grip, but it doesn't look like the one I just showed you and the one on the other, the old power control. So the sleeves look totally different. Well, this sleeve here kind of has those ridges I just showed you, but look, they look metal. They're definitely not a rubber base for sure. And then this sleeve here, I don't know how you could put this sleeve on the bottom. Almost, you know, to me, I don't know. It's almost to me, it's almost like if you do this one over here, I don't. You can't have these red wires that are right here. You can't have that on the bottom. It almost looks like. These might be, I don't know, I mean, they don't look like they interchange. Like the old ones, you can interchange all the pieces, right? So on the old design, there's what? So you got your emitters, you got two emitters, two end caps, two switches, and then four sleeves. So basically, you have one, two, three, four, five. You have five pieces. Is there still five pieces? One, two, three, four, five. So there seems to be five pieces still, which makes sense. See, this one's confusing me. The end cap, you got your end cap and you got your emitter. That's two. And where's your switch? See, this is the where I don't understand where the switch is on this one. Over here, we see kind of see where the switch is. It's right here. So is this this might be the switch here? The other, you know, little piece where the wire's sticking out. That might be the switch area. One, two, three. And then you got the grip four. And then you got the end cap five. Okay, so that's what it is. So you got your end cap. You got your sleeve or grip. Then this here, this middle piece is your switch area. Be interesting to see what the switch looks like on this one. And then you got your other sleeve, and then you got your emitter. Okay. So that's that's your five pieces. It just doesn't look like you can interswap these as good as the old design, but we'll see, because it would be kind of weird to put this sleeve on here and not have the, the wire switch with it would I think it would look kind of weird but maybe 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 not maybe I'm looking to it more than it needs to be so there it is I always see stuff like that and then you look at when people build these and like ah oh, that's pretty cool even if it doesn't have the the wire with the switch I like these I like these a lot I like I kind of like these better than the old ones where's the old one here and here's the old ones again to me to me, the, the, I don't know, the old design to me kind of looked cheap. They weren't cheap because they're made out of metal. But just the, the appearance of them kind of looked a little cheapish to me. But this new, man, this new design, they haven't you know gotten made to pieces yet. But I really like the way they look. If they come out like this, when they come out, man, they're going to look awesome. And I, I, I see people flocking back to Disney to get these because, I mean, they, they look pretty dang cool. I love that like this emitter has these this pieces coming up, and then they have it down there on the end cap. I think that's so cool. So I, I really like this new design that's coming out.
for power and control. And I guarantee that all the other ones are going to come out too. So this is just the first set that they're changing. And I guarantee all the other designs are going to change as well. Pretty neat because these came out in what, 2019? So they've been 19. So three years they've been around. So it's, it, it's, it's time for a new design. Pretty cool that they're coming out with these. Let me know what you think about this new design for power control. Do you like it or you don't like it? Leave it in the comment section below what your opinion is. And like always, if you liked the video, please hit that thumbs up for me. And if you're new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button and turn that bell on. I do have more Star Wars stuff coming up. I got some crystals coming. I got a lightsaber coming. And I got a Boba Fett crystal coming. And I got a Yoda 8-Ball crystal coming. So don't miss those videos that are going to be coming out soon. Some of them, one or two, are going to come out next week. So don't miss those. The you know, only way to do that is hit that subscribe button and turn that bell on. Until next time, I will see ya.